I think people are attracted to the school because they are ambitious. That was quite a pivotal moment for me, thinking that I was meant to be there. There's a creativeness and inventiveness that I have found nowhere else. Coming out of Montana Tech with an engineering degree, I just felt like I could accomplish anything that I really wanted to. When I graduated from high school, I decided to go to St. the Southern Alberta Institute of Technology. About six months into my working life, one of my colleagues phoned me and said, I'm going to Montana Tech. Within a couple of weeks, I was in a car with four other guys going down to check on the schools. The bond between Calgary students, the state students, and Montana Tech is, I think, very, very strong. As a matter of fact, myself and another individual that I roomed with, Grant Davis, we were the first students to officially transfer from the SAIT program to Montana Tech in the fall of 1979. When I started looking around at the options for, for schooling, it really was about two things. It was about transfer credit from SAIT and it was about options coming out of engineering. It fit perfect. I've said this many times about Montana Tech and SAIT. The two programs were really meant to work together. SAIT is a diploma program. It's there to get you ready to function and work in industry at a practical level. The university programs in engineering are at a deeper theoretical level. Montana Tech happens to be one of the best at combining practicality with theory. And you're not just using the equations, you're learning how to build the equations that you're going to use to solve problems. The Montana Tech and SAIT relationship is huge in my mind. The SAIT Montana combo is the ultimate combo in my opinion. I've seen and met a lot of people that have done it right back from when it started and the possibilities are unlimited. It'll definitely be a decision you won't regret. I grew up in uh, Vancouver, British Columbia. Calgary, Alberta. Brooks, Alberta. I love it. There's no place I'd rather be going to school. I came down to Montana Tech for my education, but there was also an, an added bonus of a hockey team. Played on the hockey team last year, so it's been really eye-opening, the experiences I've been able to have down here, both in terms of education and extracurricular activities. Part of the tech experience is feeling like you, you belong like you're part of this community right from day one. It really creates a family environment that you really work as a team and approach everything as a team. And so those, those values that come with that, the culture is created from that really in a workforce, that's, that's critical in a successful team. I started to identify the qualities of a leader and identify them with myself. That was quite a pivotal moment for me thinking that, hey, you know, I've got most of these qualities. I might need to hone them a little bit, but they're, they're there. Immediately you make you make friends and as a Canadian, if you're looking abroad and wanting to work in the U.S. and looking at your education, Montana Tech's a natural fit because you get exposure to the American side. I look at a lot of resumes and one of the first things I look for is work experience and the second thing is how did this candidate get here? If they've been through the kind of program that I think is important, that's a real highlight. And Montana Tech has a good reputation in the industry. That's a check mark that you make on your resume for sure. I feel very fortunate to have achieved what I've achieved and I understand that it's not just me that caused that, it was people around me, it was the industry that I'm in, it was the schools that I attended. I would strongly encourage any prospective students to go to Montana Tech. My career has been much more than I had expected when I started. Did I ever think I would live in Alaska? Did I ever think I would go to Japan or China? Did I think I would get the opportunity to run a complete enterprise in Canada? Absolutely not. It led me on a path that built my career. I think it helped me find my wife. And that's the other piece of advice I would give, is never give up, whether it's getting into school or getting on with your job. Keep trying, keep going. I think there's close to 1,500 students in total that have transferred from SAIT, NAIT, and BCIT as well. I always say any engineering degree, any degree is a ticket on the bus. Doesn't necessarily mean you're gonna go places with it, it's up to you from that day forward. But the fundamentals provided by the SAIT program and Montana Tech's program provide all students with a total fundamental package they need to begin to go to work immediately in that sector, to provide immediate impact in that sector, and the rest is up to them.